Ever puzzled over why your wallet seems to have a revolving door for cash? Well, you're not alone and it's not some mysterious wallet gnome playing tricks on you. It's a simple fact of life. Money, like a pet hamster, needs proper care and attention to thrive. And the first step is understanding that if you want money to work for you, you must first work for money. Imagine trying to order a piping hot pizza, mouth-watering at the thought of that cheesy goodness, only to find your pockets as empty as a politician's promises, or daydreaming about lounging on a beach somewhere exotic, a cool drink in hand, while in reality, you're stuck in a stuffy office. Sounds familiar? Well, the good news is that it doesn't have to be this way. Money can indeed be trained to work for you. Think of it as hiring your own personal army of dollar bills, ready to march out and conquer the world on your behalf. How, you ask? For starters, consider an investment in stocks. Now, this isn't some magic money tree. It requires research, understanding, and patience, but with time, it can turn a small amount of money into a significant nest egg. Or how about starting a side hustle? This could be anything from selling handmade crafts to freelance writing. The beauty of a side hustle is that it lets you earn money doing something you love. It's like getting paid to eat pizza. And let's not forget about the art of saving wisely. This isn't about hoarding every penny like a dragon with its gold, but about making smart decisions. It's about delaying that impulse buy, setting aside a portion of your income, and watching your savings grow over time. Take a cue from successful entrepreneurs who started from scratch. They knew that the road to wealth is paved with hard work, smart financial decisions, and a dash of humor. In summary, making money work for you is about more than just earning a paycheck. It's about investing wisely, nurturing a side hustle, and saving with a purpose. It's about understanding that money, like a good pet hamster, needs care, attention, and a bit of training. So the next time you find your wallet empty, remember, you're not just working for money, you're training it to work for you.